The Story of Ms. Moppet Short Stories for Kids Today we have a book named The Story of Ms. Moppet by Beatrix Potter, Short Stories for Kids. I think they're so pretty, I hope you guys really enjoy it. I love it. Please give this video a like if you enjoy it, and don't forget to subscribe for more stories. Thank you, reading. So, here we go. This is a pussy called Miss Moppet. She thinks she has heard a mouse. Mouse. This is the mouse peeping out behind the cupboard and making fun of Miss Moppet. He is not afraid of a kitten. Miss Moppet, this is Miss Moppet jumping just too late. This is Miss Moppet jumping just too late. She misses the mouse and hits her own head. She thinks it is a very hard cupboard. She thinks it is a very hard cupboard. The mouse watches Miss Moppet from the top of the cupboard. The mouse watches Miss Moppet from the top of the cupboard. Miss Moppet ties up her head in a duster and sits before the fire. Miss Moppet ties up her head in a duster and sits before the fire. Mouse comes sliding down the bell pole. The mouse thinks she's looking very ill. He comes sliding down the bell pole. The mouse comes a little nearer. Miss Moppet looks worse and worse. The mouse comes a little nearer. Miss Moppet holds her poor head in her paws and looks at him through a hole in the duster. Miss Moppet holds her poor head in her paws and looks at him through a hole in the duster. The mouse comes very close. Miss Moppet thinks she will tease the mouse. And then all of a sudden, Miss Moppet jumps upon the mouse. She ties him up in the duster. And because the mouse has teased Miss Moppet, Miss Moppet thinks she will tease the mouse. Which is not at all nice of Miss Moppet. And tosses it about like a ball. She ties him up in the duster and tosses it about like a ball. But she forgot about that hole in the duster. But she forgot about that hole in the duster. And when she untied it, there was no mouse. He has wriggled out and run away. And he is dancing a jig on the top of the cupboard. He has wriggled out and run away. And he is dancing a jig on the top of the cupboard. The End Good job, friends. Thank you so much for reading with me. Bye, I'll see you next time.